California has spent billions of dollars on homelessness programs over the past five years, but a new report finds the state failed to properly monitor all that spending on all those programs. NBC 4's Conan Nolan is here with us to discuss the details of this report. Conan. That's right. Allocating the funding, assuming your budget is fat, is easy. Figuring out where it went and if it did any good, that's the hard part. The state audit found that nobody was tracking to see if any of the billions in homeless funding was actually reducing homelessness. The state audit took a year and sought to find out where the money went, $24 billion to be exact, spent in the fight against homelessness. The report indicates nobody knows for sure. Republican Assemblyman Josh Hoover of Northern California was part of a bipartisan group of lawmakers who called for the audit. Not only did the audit struggle to measure the effectiveness of the programs that we're spending money on, in most cases, we don't have enough information to even measure the outcomes of the programs and where the dollars are going. California is spending more on the homeless crisis each year, and the number on the street continues to climb. Last year's homeless number, over 181,000. The governor took this over as his issue when he was elected and, and developed over 30 programs. State Senator Roger Niello represents Yuba County in Northern California. He believes that too much power has been concentrated in Sacramento and not in the state's 58 counties, which normally administer health services. And they've been sort of relegated to do whatever the state tells them to. And uh, that's, I think, a good deal why things are ineffective and also why they're not uh, properly reported on. The audit also analyzed homeless services in San Jose and San Diego, finding that both cities failed to thoroughly account for their spending or measure the success of many of their programs. Uh, so much of the focus at the local level is on uh, getting the dollars out the door, meeting these spending deadlines. Dr. Alice Feller is a clinical psychologist and author. She says she saw the problem while serving on a local commission, which handed out money to nonprofits in the effort to combat homelessness. The most well-funded and you know, well-established program was an art program for kids, which doesn't prevent anything. It's nice. They had, they had swag, they handed us you know, with their logos. and I mean, things like that just are bound to happen. Dr. Feller believes that we are throwing money away because we've yet to do something about what she calls our broken mental health care system. Her book, American Madness, Fighting for Patients, calls for a return to mental health hospitals to replace jails and prisons, which are frequently where mentally ill homeless end up. And of course, the lawmakers are also talking about legislation to follow the money and figure out whether all of this funding is doing any good. Swag, huh? Swag. <laughs>